traps. I always thought your game was stealing state secrets. Mm -hmm. Whatever you want from me, James, the odds are not in your favor. So recently we talked about House Edge on this channel. Real quick, it's basically how much of all the bets that are made at any given game that the casino expects to keep over time. So a 1% House Edge means that after $1,000 in bets, the casino expects to make $10. Now the lower the House Edge, the better it is for us. Blackjack is generally regarded as the game that has the lowest House Edge, about 0.42% if you play it properly. But what if I told you there is a lesser known bet that has a 0% house edge? That's right, real true odds with zero advantage to the casino. It's kind of like a casino cheat code. And I'm about to tell you what it is. Well, maybe I'll get lucky. I'm Cash Kingston, AKA Mr. Casanova, and this is how to play the 0% house edge on craps. Winner! Really? <laughs> I just rolled a seven. <laughs> now, before I tell you how to get these sweet, sweet wins under your belt, don't forget to like and subscribe to the video. I totally appreciate it, and I'll send that good juju your way. Okay, so in craps, there are two possible bets to start on the come out roll. The pass line, which means you're betting on the shooter, and the don't pass line, which means you're betting against the shooter. Once a point number has been set, you can make another bet called the odds bet on the pass line, or a lay the odds bet on the don't pass line. Now to win an odds bet, the shooter needs to roll the point number again before they roll a seven. No seven. No seven. No seven. We got a six. Okay, so if the point number is 10 or four, it'll pay you two to one on your odds bet. If it's a five or a nine, it pays three to two, and a six and eight pays six to five. These are the true odds, which is why it's considered a 0% house edge for the casino. Because the casino has zero house edge on this bet, they'll max the amount you can bet at three to five X or pass line bet, depending on where you're playing. Let's run through an example. Okay, so we're gonna start off with a $5 bet on the pass line. Roll the dice. We have a four. Okay, so the puck is on four. That means we're gonna bet $5 on the pass odds line down here. We'll get to bet three X, our pay line bet for this game. So that's one, two, three, $15. And if we can roll a four before we roll a seven, that means we get paid out two to one on our bet. Let's roll it up. There's a three still alive. Next up, 10. And that's an eight. And there's our four. And just like that, we get paid two to one on our pass odds bet, making it $30 there. And we got paid one to one on the pass line bet for a total of $35. Don't forget, you get paid two to one on four and 10, you get paid three to two on five and nine, and you get paid six to five if it's on six or eight. I can't believe that just worked. So for the record, winning on laying the odds is the opposite. You're betting on the shooter rolling a seven before the point number. It has lower payouts if you win. However, it is still a true odds bet. It's just less fun. So there you have it, a 0% house edge bet you can make at the craps table. You're not gonna find better odds anywhere in the casino. Craps is always a ton of fun. It's fun to roll the dice. It's fun to win with everybody else. And I'd love to know in the comments if you've ever made this bet, if you've had success with it. Also, if you take the time to like and subscribe, I will owe you big time. I am Cash Kingston, AKA Mr. Casanova. And we'll see you next time.